Hello, boys and girls. My name is Hotsusti, and welcome back to Factorio. We are here in the midst of uh, setting up our factory for a rocket silo. Last time we figured out how to deal with the, the copper wire uh, and we also added the uh, uh, solid fuel. So today we want to focus a bit on the, uh, the circuits that we need. And the first one of course will be the green one. Um, there we need a red belt input of um, of uh, iron plates and two red belts input of uh, copper wires and uh, that's a bit of a difficult situation so let's let's figure out how we can do this so if we have it like this we need modules in here we need that's that's for the uh, that's for the the wires because if we have we have five machines and 50 wires so each machine has to insert 10 wires per second uh, we also need three uh, three beacons so we need a fast inserter here uh, maybe have that here on the side because then we can basically do this and have output priority here. We have three, three belts there. So, and then we also need, um, iron and I'm thinking we do that this way um, how much iron do we actually need um, that's a bit more than than three iron so um, if we look at our bonuses we have fast inserters plus two that's that's three so fast inserter here will do and then how many will we output uh, total um, about five per second so for the output we want to have fast inserters. So, and let's do it that way. And then we need three beacons. We can have one here and two there. And then let's let's do it this way. That way we can combine everything together. And then if we have this here, we just need to 
have this there. And probably we can bring in the power here on this side. And this should be tileable five times. So let's actually remove this here. So we can place this down five times. Let's copy this. One, two, three, four, five. And we probably can do away with every other, or we could even have just two. And then here we need the iron. Um, let's bring iron around here. This setup here, we use. Uh, let's see, we are producing a total of uh, uh, 63, 64 um, copper wires, and we are using 50, so that's 14 per second that still remain um, so probably we can just do this and we don't need these additional two lanes for copper wire because it will be it will be enough Actually, here we also don't need that anymore. And what we should do is hook this up so that uh, the first, um, the first few can also have um, producing green circuits. Um, we are. Producing, yes. So let's actually bring those then back here, and then we can think about how to uh, do the red circuits. But before we do that, let me. Uh, clean this up a bit well, so we have actually the, the space here um, and then we will figure out how to do the red one I think I have an idea if we look at the at the recipe uh, this one is the last one where we need the copper cables and we need about half the amount of copper or the, the, the green circuits and uh, plastic bars than we have copper cables. So copper cables is one belt and we can combine the uh, plastic and the circuits 
on a second belt have that input on one side and then the output on the other side and will still be able to have beacons. Um, we will have to see if we use this setup uh, or if we use a different one. But first things first, let's we want to bring this closer to the, the, the factory. And we also want to have this here. So let's do this and that and then this That's our two input lines. So, and let's have factory here. And here, red circuits are not that fast. That's why we need 12 factories in total. Um, and that's basically, um, one per per second. So I think here we are okay with with a fast inserter, and because we need two materials from this line, let's have two long-handed inserters, and then output. Um, We will use the same mechanism as we did before. And with this, we can have it uh, like we want it. Because if we, this is then basically uh, one tileable, uh, only here on the outside. We need to have two additional beacons uh, to get that in. So, that's that. And, ooh, yeah. We have to see about the power. We will do that at the end. So here we need that 12 times. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And then beacon, beacon. So let's set up the, the power stations here, here, and here, and we need a bit of uh, tweaking here. And then 
here we need some underground. There we have the red circuits. Let's bring those around here. Apparently I'm missing productivity modules for, for the whole shebang. But we have red circuit production. So, next thing, of course, is blue circuit production. And before I do that, I will fetch myself a more productivity module and restock on everything else that I am lacking. On to blue circuits. If we look at it here, we have really a small amount for the output not even one circuit per second so for one we will be good with a yellow output belt uh, and we can even just add everything on the same side of the belt and then after all our four assembly machines we can sort out that the belt is uh, evenly balanced. Um, we have um, 11 or 12 per second of the green circuits and uh, 1.2 of the, of the red ones. So I think um, what we can do here is maybe let's move that a bit further up here um, let's bring the green ones a bit closer to here and, and this like so and then we will have how how does it work out? Do we need fast inserters or not? Um, so we have four machines, uh, twelve. Uh, that's three per second. So we should be good with a fast inserter here and long-handed inserter there. And then, as we said, we can just put that out here. And this one is like so. And here we also need uh, to have the uh, The sulfuric acid so we will bring that on here on on the outside that uh, should not be a big problem productivity speed and then we copy this one two three for total of four times so let's have this here then this there connect it there and voila Now we just need to get ourselves a bit of uh, this sulfuric acid here from the side. Should 
Shall we pump it? Yes, we will pump it. Um, yes, that even reaches to here. And then we can have balancing And this one will be like that. Oh, um, let's bring that back a bit because here we also want to have two beacons for additional speed. So we will have to wait this this like so and that's the blue circuits all the way down here actually this should be removed need the copper wires here because all at all things that use copper wires have been set up so yeah they receive that's that was a dead end anyway so in here nice and this should be enough circuits for all our future needs so if we look what we will do next is uh, the batteries, those need sulfuric acid. We will have them here in this area where we do have the sulfuric acid anyway. Uh, maybe um, have it here on, on this side. And then here on this side where we have light oil, we will have the, the rocket fuel factory. Uh, and we will spiral this whole thing in uh, all the way to our rocket silo, which will sit right here in the middle. And then we only have to figure out how to bring the uh, space science packs from the middle to the outside uh, to a station, which will be either here or there. But that's it for today. We have covered uh, all the three colors of circuits. Very nice. So don't forget to tune in next time when we will make even more progress towards our rocket silo. Until then, goodbye.